Hey y'all, it's Lana Moore here. I'm back with another video. How's my sunshine squad doing? Hello everyone. We are back. We're on a roll like Cotton L. I posted a video like last week and I'm here back with another video this week. This week is going to be all of my favorites for kind of the month of April. A little bit going into May, but mainly April because April um, was my birthday month. So happy belated, belated birthday to me. Um, yeah, I have tried a lot of makeup out in that month. I kind of purchased a lot of makeup that month, it seemed like. So I accumulated, obviously, some favorites that I like. And majority of the favorites that I'm featuring in today's video, I did either use it on my face today or I have used it in a previous video or previ I just previously used it and I just really love it. So if you like to watch favorites videos, grab a snack, sit back, relax and enjoy. Toodles to my sunshine squad. Yes, 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 yes. So yeah, let's just go ahead and get right into this video. So the first product that is my favorite is literally these Onest um, Beauty Liquid Glitter Liners. I literally discovered them on Amazon. Um, it's literally a pack of glitter liner. Literally, that's all it is. I used number six in my last video, um, which was about the blue hue. So I'll be sure to leave that in the cards above. And I've used them in like posts. I've used, I believe, either this one or this one. And I've played with a lot of the colors um, lately. So really love these. If you just want some inexpensive glitter liner just to have on hand, honestly, I would get them. They're on Amazon and I will link them down below. I got them because I wanted to do a glitter like line in my cut crease and I was like, I need that. So yeah, that's the reason why I like them. I really love them, easy to use. And honestly, they're worth what they are. And they're inexpensive too. So my next item while it's falling is the Kiss Lash Glue and Eyeliner All-in-One and I'm actually wearing it today. This is one product I am actually wearing today. I have it in the color black. I do want to go back and get the clear one and kind of try that one out to see how that one works but definitely worth it. I did play with it and I'm still, it's still in my trial and error part, so I'm like still learning how to use it. However, I learned today that I kind of low-key need to double go over it twice for my lashes to stick perfectly. It says, on here it shows you the instructions of how to use it. Um, it says, along your natural lash line, before the liner has a chance to dry, immediately apply the Kiss Floss Flash and pat the set latch of like repeat on your other eye yeah okay so you have me personally i don't know if it's just my eyes i've noticed i had to apply it at least a nice two times <laughs> in order for it to really adhere and get sticky but yes that's what it looks like and like i said i got it in the color black and i do want to try the clear one out so the next favorite on my list is this BH Cosmetics, check out my makeup y'all, this BH Cosmetics Diamond Palette. I love this palette and honestly I've tried it but my favorite color low key is this pressed glitter. I don't want to swatch it but you know what I'm going to anyway. But yeah, it's the bling bling for me. So there you go, it kind of reminds me of glitter. Um, if you guys ever watched that movie Glitter but Mariah Carey, that's what it reminds me of, like just this line of glitter. But yeah, it's a really pretty palette. It's their birthstone vault palette. It uh, has the color stunning. Very pretty if you want to do something like, um, like for New Year's Eve. This is a really good palette for New Year's Eve. Next product that is my favorite is the curls blueberry bliss control paste i know this is weird to have this product in my favorites but hear me out i literally saw a trend i saw a lot of videos lately and i saw people putting like you know how that brow freezes out by abh 
And I was like, I don't, I haven't got a chance to grab the brow freeze, but I did see someone use this and use like gel. Like I've been seeing people use pomade on their brows and I was like, let me try that out. So I used it, it's actually on my brows today, y'all. And don't be sleeping if you don't want to spend $23 on ABH and literally want to be able to have like the product last you longer because like that ABH one's like this little and like this one literally will last you longer. So if you just want to go with that, I am a witness of reference. Yes. Uh, the next thing is going to be this Photo Focus Wet n Wild Matte Primer. I'm also wearing this on my face today as well. Really love how it smooths out my skin. I feel like my face looks flawless even though uh, I'm breaking out like crazy, but it looks really good. Like, looks really, really good. So definitely, and it's inexpensive too. I can't remember how much it is, but it is inexpensive. Next find is literally my favorite. I recently got this, that's why I said it's kind of an April it going into May favorites, because of Leslie Marie. Um, Leslie Marie, she's a beauty guru I've been watching lately and she had this in her favorites video and I was like, you know what, I have to go try it because she said it's good and usually most of the favorites videos I be watching, they be having good recommendations, they do. That's why I be going out and getting stuff. This brush is amazing. I used it all over my face today. Look at how nice my application of makeup is. Blended out my contour with this, blend out everything with this brush. This brush is everything. I need to literally, she was right. I gotta go get more. I literally gotta go get like two, three more. This brush is amazing. Yes, it made it for a reason. Next, I know people are going to be surprised that I'm even putting this in my favorites video, especially if you watch my Jess Up makeup review <laughs> of how I felt about this powder. But yes, I actually have this powder on my face, literally under my eye, um, a little under my contour, like all over my face, basically in those T-zone areas, I would say like under the eyes, nose, forehead, like basically the spots where you would highlight literally love this powder now i see why it was a big craze when i was watching reviews about it yes definitely love it it's i figured out how to use it i think my skin that day was probably super dry itself as to why i didn't like it why it was patchy it was probably me just i probably didn't prep my skin enough but my skin, trust me, was prepped enough today. Um, so yes, definitely love this, it's worth it. And you get a lot for the amount you spend. I think it's like five or six bucks and you get this much. And I think I got this last year and I still have a full thing of it. And I use it, I mean, I don't use it every day, but I use it enough to wear. I still have some leftover. The next um, product I have as a favorite is the Milani Make It Last setting spray it is a prime correct plus set i think i also saw this in someone's video and it made me want to try it okay low key that i spent some type of way because when i ordered it off of amazon tell me why the bottle looked bigger than this and i'm thinking like oh that's pretty good you know i'm thinking i'm about to get on amazon this looks so much bigger than what it is in person and i was like i know i didn't get the little bottle of this little bottle of setting spray but low-key it's funny in its name it does make it last i've used this more than one time and i still have a nice amount left so yeah i would definitely do repurchase this again really love it i have it on today of course i have it on today like i said majority of the products that i'm fav showing as my favorites i have them on except the diamond palette and the glitter liner yeah, majority of the products I'm showing, I have one of them, one or more of them on. So yeah. Okay, so the last product is actually going to be lashes. I went lash crazy um, when I was purchasing lashes. So the lashes I have, these are a thicker lashes. These lashes came from Amazon, as you see, their space is missing. So I have used them more than once. These are like a thicker lash band. I used these in my Blue Hues makeup tutorial. I think I used the style at the top, the style over here on this side. 
I think that's the style I used for that makeup tutorial. These also came from Amazon. Really love these. If you love a thick lash band, you'll definitely love these. Um, they're good for like dramatic looks, if you're doing dramatic looks, and even if you're doing like a semi like natural look. Like even I could have put them on with this, but I went opted out for a more natural lash. I opted out for a more natural lash for this look. And the lashes I have on actually are these ones. Stuff don't like me today. I'm about tired of this stuff falling. So I have this lash on today actually right now. These are more of a thinner lash band. These are also from Amazon. I will link them down below in the description box just in case you do like them. So yeah, this is a pack of 50. It was a pack of 50, so it was 10 lashes and five different styles. And like I said, I have these ones on today, but I have used, I haven't used this style yet. I haven't used this one yet. I think one just fell out. I haven't used this style yet. I think one honestly just fell and I'm kind of disappointed because that's me now I'm missing a lash. But I, I used so far these two styles. Oh my gosh, I just got makeup on my outfit. But yeah, I've used these two styles and I love them so far. I like them. We'll love them. All right, you all, that is all my favorites for the month of April. I know like even though like I like I said, I used a lot of makeup. Um, some of it I'm still like iffy about as to why I didn't make this video longer. Hopefully this video is not that long because yeah. So yeah, be sure to give this video a thumbs up, like, comment, and subscribe, and let me know what products that you are loving um, right now that maybe I can try, you know, because I'm always down to try new makeup. So yeah, toodles to my sunshine squad, and I'll see you all in the next one. Bye.